mennä syttymään oppuja lampeille. En mä voida, mä luulen, että alkaa nyt sataa. Meidän täytyy lähteä kotiin. Mennään. Okay. Tuu. Most national weather services in the world are able to provide accurate precipitation forecasts, and some of them can provide short-term forecasts using the information gathered by their meteorological radar networks. Forecasts produced using national radar composites can provide relevant information about when and where it will start raining. And these high-resolution forecasts, available up to two hours in advance, can be extremely useful for anticipating the effects of rainfall upon our lives. Finnish Meteorological Institute has eight weather radar systems. From these weather radars we disseminate products to the users all around the country. Among the users are civil protection authorities, ordinary citizens and for example kindergartens. Radar images are crucial for meteorologists when making forecasts. Moreover, they are simple to interpret so that the general public can easily use them to make day-to-day -day decisions. As a result, they are extremely popular and have become one of the most visited institutional web pages in many countries. In kindergarten we use radar image information every day in order to decide what kind of clothes we put for the children outside and when do we go outside. It's very important for us as well. But beyond this general use for our daily activities, high-resolution rainfall forecasts become crucial when heavy rains appear. Hazards induced by heavy rainfalls, specifically floods, are one of the major natural hazards affecting Europe and produce emergency incidents every year. To face these emergencies, the anticipation of heavy rainfall is of utmost importance for civil protection. High resolution rainfall forecast is very important for us because we have to be ready to intervene where necessary. We have to be capable of uh, being very proactive in order to make sure that uh, the response we plan and we implement is coming in the right time. The Opera Project is an important collaborative effort by the National Meteorological Services to produce joint radar composites for Europe. It produces rainfall maps of two kilometers resolution every 15 minutes. This composite has been operationally available since June 2011. Uh, OPERA is the weather radar program of UMNET, the network of European Meteorological Services. It was established in 1999 and has about 30 member organizations. A major effort within the last few years in Opera has been building of the Opera data center, which we call Odyssey, uh, which collects radar data from 20 countries and of about 130 radars and produces network wide uh, radar composites uh, uh, at every 15 minutes.
To extend these national high-resolution rainfall forecasts to cover all of Europe, the EU Civil Protection launched the project HARA in 2012. The European radar composites produced by OPERA are used in the project HAREN to provide high-resolution forecasts up to six hours in advance. The aim is to develop a tool to add value to this amazing information and assist the forecasters in their support to the civil protection authorities. The project is coordinated by the Centre of Applied Research in Hydrometeorology at the UPC with the collaboration of the Meteorological Institutes of Finland and Austria and the Finnish Department of Rescue Services. The civil protection bodies of Lower Austria and Spain are participating as stakeholders. The cooperation with research and the meteorological forecasters is very important for us because uh, weather-induced uh, emergencies are very common and very frequent uh, in Europe and we have to be in a position to preempt and to plan uh, in good time in order to have a good response uh, for people affected by floods or other weather-induced uh, emergencies. The forecasting technique estimates the motion field of the precipitation as depicted by the radar mosaics. From the radar observations, we obtain the motion field shown here with the red arrows using a tracking algorithm. Finally, the forecasts are generated by extrapolating the most recent radar observations into the future according to the estimated motion field. For instance, here we have an example in which we are extrapolating the observed rainfall field uh, up to six hours. Although these techniques are based on the extrapolation of the latest observations, when they are applied to networks of radars on a continental scale, they can provide high-resolution rainfall forecasts up to six hours in advance. The high-resolution uh, rainfall forecast is, is very important for rescue services because uh, in that way we can put our resources in the right places at the right time. As soon as possible. Okay, thank you very much for the information. Let's keep in touch on this emergency. It is useful for us because it allows us to, to better target and to narrow down the area uh, of interest and this is very important because uh, the local conditions can influence uh, the response and the situation very much. The Haren project has adapted the state-of-the-art methodologies to the European continental scale. The interest is not just to provide rainfall forecasts, but to transform them into advanced information able to identify where hazards will occur in the next hours, providing support to the emergency centers in Europe. With the assistance of Meteoralarm, we have adopted the regional warning levels to our European warning tool to generate regional warnings which follow the ample scheme of Meteor Alarm, which is easily to understand. Yellow for there's something going on, orange for be aware, and red for take action. The Haran project has also developed new products based on the combination of meteorological models and radar-based forecasts, tracking of storm cells and associated heavy rainfall, as well as a dynamic hazard assessment on a regional scale. At the FMI we are improving existing precipitation forecasting methods by combining information from meteorological models with European-wide precipitation maps from Opera radar network. And these new methods are also probabilistic, which make it possible to estimate the risk that is associated to the event occurrence. We have introduced a method to detect intensified precipitation cells, to monitor them over time and to predict the future position and the future development based on the historic of the cell. The developments carried out by the Haran project have been tested by a number of stakeholders, including meteorological forecasters and civil protection emergency centers, and have been used to follow the heavy rainfall events occurring during 2013. 
year 2013 was very challenging for forecasting and for crisis management. The Haran project proved to be very helpful and very supportive for the forecasters' work to have an objective analysis of the radar situation and the precipitation situation and to give the best information available then on to crisis management. The Haran project is the first attempt to use the OPERA data to provide hazard assessment on a European scale. And the results are extremely encouraging. Haren is a demonstration project showing the added value of high-resolution rainfall forecasts. It also supports applied research oriented to force the meteorological and civil protection cooperation at the European scale. Äiti! Suomi on aina vaikka Ranskassa. Siis myös Englannissa sataa. No niin, sataakin. Miksi sä Englannissa? Joo, se on siellä työmatkalla. Voimme syötä sen sitten taas eteenpäin. Voitko sä soittaa?